And it's also all love all the time over at The Good Place on NBC. Kristen Bell made sure of that. Just don't be a jerk. Don't be a jerk. You know? We're so lucky to be here. Especially in a job like this where we're doing comedy, there's like no excuse. Don't be a jerk. There's a no ash hole policy, mm -hmm. that's oh. what we would say yeah. on the show. Every single person on set is nice and funny. A rare combination. Kristen's no jerks rule is just one of the reasons why this is the good place. And the fact that these on set shenanigans happen is another. In spite of all the fun they're having, Kristen says, thanks to series creator Mike Schur, she already knows how the series will end. Kind of. I barely remember what he said because my memory is just, my, I have the worst memory in the world. So um, I'm a great secret keeper yep. because I don't remember the secret. Uh, nor will I judge you for it. Amazing. Um, but yes, he has thrown out some ideas that would happen should we wrap the show up in seven years. Recalling afterlife memories here on Earth has some significant side effects. Tonight's episode is all about repressed memories. Meanwhile, in real life, Ted and Kristen are making their own memories to last a lifetime. I heard that she took you to an escape room. We were there with my wife, Mary, yeah. and her husband, Dax. And you had one flashlight for each group. <gasps> Well, I gave the flashlight to Dax yeah. and noticed that there was a cot in our cell, stretched out and took a nice little doze for the 20 minutes it took. Yeah. We didn't get out, but everyone else was bummed out. I was rested and happy <laughs> as a clam.